Okay, so this is uh, Ted Maiman's uh, original notebook from the day uh, that the uh, first laser fired. You can see his uh, voltage uh, notes uh, ramping up uh, as he uh, increased voltage and uh, right after uh, uh, 1.24 kV you can see his notes of what the hell's happening, you know. Uh, uh, so I think that's his aha moment there uh, when he started seeing laser action. And next to it is a uh, mock-up of his first uh, laser apparatus, uh, the headpiece. You see his stubby ruby laser there uh, and the flash lamp and his reflector. And down below here you find the uh, Hughes Aircraft Company Model 200 ruby laser head. That was the first uh, commercial laser that Hughes uh, made. Uh, that was first uh, made available in 1962. Um, it has the, essentially the same design. It's got the same flash lamp surrounding a bit longer of a rod. You see a trigger transformer in the back end um, and just the wires going in. You know what? I'm going to pull it out. You and up above there you see a uh, ND glass or ND YAG laser uh, designed by Ted Maiman. Uh, that was on his uh, coffee table, I guess, right? Uh, 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 Kathleen Maiman's. Uh, Kathleen uh, Maiman's uh, table. Uh, never went into production, just an experimental piece from the hands of Ted Maiman. I'm going to pull the notebook out if you actually want to get some video footage of it. home for the night. Lots of old lasers. It's hard to find pictures of the old lasers. There are all the descriptions, but nobody shows pictures of what the old lasers look like. It's really great that you also got a lot of Yeah. Oh yeah, I think it's cool. These are amazing. Well, this one comes like that. That's neat to have you over. That's really, really is, uh...